In this video, I'm going to teach you how to construct a question using correct sentence structure communication parsing syntax grammar. To begin with, let's start out with a statement of a claim in correct sentence structure. For the location claim of the domicile is with the knowledge by this claimant. Backwards, for this claimant of the knowledge is with the domicile by the location claim. The claimant is telling us that they are located at their domicile, at home. It's a statement of location and the location is home with the knowledge by the claimant. You have a cause, consequence, cogitation, possessive authority. And then backwards, cause, consequence, cogitation, possessive authority. In order to draw a straight line, you must have two points to know which direction the line is going in. Once you have those two points, now you can draw your straight line and there's no question as to where you're going. In the correct sentence structure, using the same concept, you need two facts in order to know where the claim is going. The cause and the consequence function as those two points, those two facts. Then you can drop the verb of the thinking in, the cogitation. In this case, it is is, because there are two verbs, is, singular, and are, plural. So once you drop that verb of the thinking in there, now you can continue along that straight line, that same line, that same geometric level plane field of contract conveyance into your possessive and your authority. So there's no question. The volition is snugly dropped in there. There's no question as to the volition now because you know what the cause is, you know what the consequence is, you know what the possessive is, and you know who the authority is or what the authority is. There's no question and there is closure on everything that's going on here because of course you would include a dictionary and give finite means for every word here. The positionals, the lodials, the verb, and the facts. Here's a syntax key for this group of wordings. We have two for verb, five for positional, six for lodial, seven for fact. The way it would be syntaxed with the correctness would be position lodial fact. This is a compound known, a compound fact hyphenated and underlined. Position lodial fact, verb, position lodial fact, positional lodial fact. 567, 5672, 567, 567. Now, if you want to ask this question, maybe I want to ask the claimant, are you home? Now, if I ask them, are you home? Well, that's a pronoun adverb verb. So I want to ask them in correct sentence structure. The way you would do that is to simply take the verb of the thinking and place it at the beginning of the sentence. Because now, the volition is in question. If we put the verb at the beginning, we don't know where it's going. Hence, it is a question. The thinking, the volition is in question. Is for the location claim of the domicile with the knowledge by this claimant? Are you home? Backwards, is for this claimant of the knowledge with the domicile by the location claim? And that's how you would do it. As a caveat, in my own personal correct sentence structure claims, I don't really use questions because I'm there to make 
statements of fact. But there are some times, especially when you're communicating with someone else who is conversant in correct sentence structure, you can ask questions like this. Although again, I prefer not to. I prefer to make statements of fact. Hope this was helpful. If you like it, hit the thumbs up, subscribe, turn on your notifications. I appreciate your viewership. Thanks for watching.